All right, we're back from gameplay. We're up against Aatrox top. He is running Arcane Comet. I mean, it's kind of the right idea because he wants to go for poke on us instead of all-ins, but this does mean that if we do catch him in the all-in, we should be able to knuckle him down. Now, we gotta <clears throat> put our dodging pants on because if we allow him to land his Qs on us, then he's gonna be much more difficult to put down. W usage is also very important. Gotta set it up with EW or just like flash into it with Ignite to put him down. But yeah. Gotta be careful level 1. He has a pretty big range advantage on us and his Q is better than any ability we can come up with early. Level 1. Oof. Not good to get hit by them. Yeah, because of how his Q's work, it just lands up every time, doesn't it? Huh? That was annoying. I'm surprised you didn't get caught by their E. Try to catch him when he's like queuing into me like that. Well, QE. I think the thing to watch out for in this lane is him to E into you. If an Xbox E dashes into you, he's just dead, kinda. So I gotta uh, either get him to waste his abilities or just have him walk up to the lane and then get on him. Violence is my business. And business is a boon. No cannon for you. Good. Not the worst trade. Could have been significantly better though. <laughs> that was a tragedy. That was a tragedy for the enemy team. Straight up tragic. <laughs> they're gonna be, they're gonna be like <laughs> all the homies who aren't from like Western countries. Generations down the line, they're gonna remember this day as a remembrance of that tragedy. <laughs> There's gonna be a holiday today, 10 years later, to remember this tragedy. <laughs> I, I know it sounds insane if you're like from... Like, if you're from any... Like, if you're not just not from America, you know what I'm talking about. I mean, maybe you are. Maybe in America they do this too. I don't know. Not a hamburger myself. They make a big deal out of like... I guess you, you kind of do, right? Yeah, yeah, you do make a big deal out of this. Everyone does. Yeah, okay. I guess you get it then. I was going to mention the exact example of this, but I remember that doing so will just get me demonetized. So, yeah. Let's just say the two dates add up to a hundred. Add up to twenty. <laughs> the 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 date and the month added together add up to twenty. Kind of like that. They're gonna remember it like that. Anyway, not sure what that tangent was about. I'm sorry. Just kind of going crazy there. My metaphors. I feel like I just want to be a bit like communicative. So when I say this, say something, I just want to make sure that it's understood. You know what I'm saying? Huh? Huh? That lands. 
A demand that needs punching. Huh. Come on. This spot is terrible. Finally, we're out of it. Gotta get those all attack cancels in with the ult with the ultimate. Cause he if you guys noticed, he reset his auto attack timer with his E. So I had to ult there to make sure to cancel that auto attack. Which would probably pull me down if it went through. Nice, let's get out of here. Got a lot of gold to shop with. I got a lot of weight on my shoulders. <laughs> Dude, this is like a whole like this is the start of a villain arc. This guy is going to be a whole villain. Like He's going to grow up to be a whole villain because of this one moment. <laughs> we just created a villain, dog. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, I don't even have an item lead on him anymore. <laughs> He's died so many times and respawned so many times that briefly the item gap had closed. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, now we got a stride, so... Yeah. The sit should be a little hopeless for him. Just a tiny bit. Now, we gotta go for Merc Shreds here, because they're Lissandra and Kopi are on CC. So yeah, Merc Shreds, Shoujin, into, I'm thinking, DMP or something. Gotta run around in this match, I feel like. Got his flash. Good. Yeah, he's not staying good. He is. Alright, has his ult gone. Ah, I didn't have my W. Got the kill, but ugh. I should have played it a bit more patiently. If I waited a tiny bit more and just flashed in to kill him there, then I would have had my like. I mean, like I waited like one more second and then I flash in, kill him, right, and then W as I'm about to walk out of the turret. Because then what happened is while I would like you know, I wouldn't die there because while I would be under the turret range. The W shield will be able to tank that one last big turret shot for me there. So yeah, a bit, a bit of a miscalculation from my end. I went for Merc because I just want the extra move speed right now. But yeah, I'm gonna go for a Shoujin next. The Spear of Shoujin. Yeah, that Twitch is fed. Mm -mm, not good. Gotta get DMP so I can just try to wrap around and get to him. Hmm. 
We can Loki just dive kill him here. Okay, this ain't looking good. I hope he thinks he can kill me. Never mind. Well, at least we lived, so that's good. Hmm. I tried to ult the Lissandra into the Twitch, but the angle was a bit off, so I couldn't. Ah, honestly, if I just altered the, I could have just altered the Twitch there, no? Yeah, yeah, I could have. Hmm. Let's get that DMP earlier than usual, then. Uh, get the armor in. I feel like the stats I have don't matter as much as just my cheesing power. I gotta cheese this guy. I just catch him when he's alone or something like that. Okay. <laughs> what is? Going on, dog. Hmm. <clears throat> yeah, we're just giving this gold to their bot lane, which is insane. God. Right. Looks like we've got some carrying to do. Got an ultimate 40. Good. Dude, are you kidding me? Ugh, he ghosted. Don't, don't thumbs up me when you're being worthless here. Like the gall to do that is crazy when you manufactured this problem. Crazy that that guy actually got a kill. Like, crazy that that guy got a kill. Also, why are we just giving up turrets to these two, man? Like, can we, like... Just, just, like, don't, don't, don't charm or anything, okay? God forbid any of you be useful. Oh my god. Dude, I caught them. It didn't matter, though. W earlier, didn't matter. We ran into the problem of us being like it's just the classic thing of like they have a Fed ADC. So it's like it's not just the Fed ADC, but it's like I can't make any plays against them because nobody like just it's not just they don't follow up, they don't have the capacity to follow up. They're unable to follow up. So that's just like makes this game way more difficult than it should be because normally I should be able to kill the ADC but no. It's how many times you get back up. These bozos won't work with me. Seems like I gotta just try to find a way to work with them but it's like like look at the spread like it's like a decent one but like they're all like here right no one's putting pressure or doing anything on the map so it's like I'm trying to be aggressive and make plays but because nobody is doing anything it frees up the entire enemy team to just go on me. 
and I'm the only one defending things too, right? Like, we just let them have this, full plating gold, this, everything. Ugh. This Twitch is already two items. More than halfway to his third. Dude, I tried to... I wanted to ultimate into the Twitch, but he just jumped on him. Okay, I guess I caught- I mean, Ari has a brain. That's good. Okay, Ari has a brain. That's perfect. Ari's good, Ari's good, Ari's good. Good. I just needed this bit of hope. Which is alive again. Let's get out. He got my DMP, then I'll build for the Shujin. The Kraken of Bones. Let's go get the bot beef too. Might as well while I'm at it. Yeah, Trox is fed now. <sighs> I just died against their bot lane too many times in a row. Get our DMP. I can say you learn a lot from a beating. If that's true, I've made the whole world smarter. Okay. That was a little risky from him. Yeah, we don't really have anybody down here, so we can't exactly fight for it. Let's go for this Aatrox then. This is Argon. If I ever find my old man, well, I hope Ah, God. Get knuckled down, bro. Up there. Let's get the turret. I didn't kill him. So he just jumped over this wall, right? Okay, let's get our Warhammer. Master once said, "Be like water. You're some kind of a tsunami." Everyone loses. Well, almost everyone.
There we go. Let's get that objective bounty. Turret. Let's try and get whatever I can. Like, sconch everything from everywhere. Atrox has farmed up quite a bit in the meantime of me dying to the Twitch, which means that killing him is now just way more worth it than usual. I'm gonna go for this turret right here, too. Might as well. If the Twitch shows up, I can try to just flash on him and kill him quickly. But he'll probably have his sums warning. Yeah, that's a lot of gold. Nice. That is a ton of money. Okay. We got our Shoujin. Let's head up here. I'm gonna go for Destiny Ass next. Oh, that ain't good. That ain't good. Mm -mm. Look, it's a fox! Okay, good. Got him. Nice. Woo! That's how it's done, baby. Yeah, we just mobbed them. That car that was pretty good, too. Good timing. I'm not sure if the... Senna can hold bot lane, though. Don't get caught now. Use your range. He just died. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Rip. I used to risk my neck in the bit making someone else rich. Now we do it the other way around. Alright, I gotta just go be with the team more. They're gonna get themselves killed otherwise. Let's grab this dragon though, at least. Don't have flash this time around, so things might get a bit more... ...rough. Okay. Let's get in here, let's get in here. He doesn't have any land juice? Uh, okay. That sucks. Yeah, I should try to get an ult off, but they have, they have too much CC for me to just wave away. True damage, though. Mm -hmm. Not optimal. Oh, well. I'm gonna go for Sterax. I think the durability is quite important in this case. You just, just keep going, keep going! Yeah, just run. Sprint! <sighs> okay. That gets him right. Nice! Good. Okay, he dies there. Good enough. He doesn't get the turret. Yeah, I'm just gonna not push up too far. Just get a few waves and then join the team. Because if I'm there while they're trying to kill my team, then I can just ult like, the, the Braum or something into the Twitch and just mob them. Just kill him. Know what I'm saying? So yeah. Okay, Twitch is still dead. Because he's giving us a bit of lead room. Leeway. Or leg room. Both works. Just mix up the two uh, sayings. Let's move up mid. Good that they're falling back a bit.
I'll just hang around. I need a gr this is like a great angle until a Frank. So I have to maintain it without blowing my cover. Good, good, good. I'm behind him, I'm behind him. That's the twitch that that was a perfect charm. Good. Perfect charm, perfect charm. I'll go just watch out for the Aatrox split, and then... This should be okay. Town goes and he's dead. I'll chase like this. So that I chase him down, and then kill him. Instead of chasing him into like the... Wall dash. Of course he has another dash lined up. He died pretty easily there. Good. There's one more wave coming up. You should get that. You swing on the boss. Uh oh. Not good stuff. Let's try to run up there. If I can catch the Twitch alone, but he's not gonna be alone. Brom's always with him. Hmm. I can maybe just tank stuff here. Kaisa can work. Let me get in here, let me get in here, let me get in here. Okay. Okay, let's go Starx and then go for el the Elixir of Wrath. <sighs> Perfect. Okay, doing good so far. It was a bit bad that we didn't get to kill the uh, Twitch, but it is what it is. Uh oh. Yeah, he might just kill the Kaisa here. Just ult here and then. Okay, yep. Gotta get here quickly. Whoa, dude, we got there just in time. Well, the others did. Legitimate business. Let's run up there then. I remember my first fight. I she wiped my tears. We're clearing the wave here. Why? Gotta go. Tank another army. Yep, I'm gonna go mid. Actually, I don't really have much to farm for, so let's just go help. Whatever, don't care. Not the one that needs farm on full build. Okay, things are going quite well so far. Man, that like a bunch of few good fights, and we're we're on the up and up. We're coming back. Yeah, that W was killer there. W plus card this are, and the Twitch was just gone. You calling me out? What? 
You disgusting cheeser. Yeah, as a waste of time, IRL, you must be good at wasting other people's time in game too. Whatever. Oh man, we're just <laughs> we're able to see us range with just the left punch. That's crazy. That's crazy. Let's not push up too far. If I go in alone, maybe I'll do some damage, but we'll get caught and killed, which is not good. His uh, Edge of Night's gone. What? What? Did she just use that thing? Also, how did my E not go through? What else? That was crazy. Hey, anyone know whose teeth are stuck in my knuckles? <laughs> Gotta get back here. Dude, I wish someone else could keep these lays pushed. I'm too important to just be away from this team. Or the team in general. Uh, yeah. This is why we gotta stay with the team. Okay, Karthus Gaming. Nice, one more, more. Good, good, good. GG, GG. Okay, they actually handled their own. Like, they, they handled themselves. Let's end. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. I don't mind tanking. We need to defend the minions. GG. Alright, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Alright, we're up against Rengar. Let's do this. This one's a bit of a tough one because Rengar has essentially got infinite mobility so long as there's things for him to jump on. So we gotta be a little careful. There we go. The thing about the W, start level 1, is that it's not just- you're not doing it just for the damage, but you're also doing it for the shield. That shield stopped them from killing us, and it let us basically just brute force knuckle them down with our fists and ignite. So yeah, pretty, pretty good. Now, as I was saying, Rengar is a bit of a... Uh, weird champion to fight when you're playing top lane set because he's got a lot of mobility, right? He can just jump around a lot, so you really have to just secure your E's with your W, and even then he can just W, W, run out of them. The whole point is that you gotta just straight up maul him in every single situation, and also, you gotta get anti-heal as soon as possible. The thing about the Rengar player and, like, the way they trade is that if they're good, Right? If they're bad, they're just going to run into you and fight every time, which means that they're killable. But if they're good at the game, they're going to jump in, do some damage, but then WW out. That will cleanse all CC, that will give them a ton of move speed, and then it will heal basically all the damage you'll get to them. So, the trade essentially is just for nothing. We can't let him do that. And the easiest way to just, like prevent him from winning the trade like that is just getting anti heal, Because anti heal just does cut his damage down, cut his healing down quite a bit, right? Now, we'll see how good this guy is. But, you know, I think you gotta treat your opposing top laner as, like, <clears throat> as good a player until they show otherwise. And we haven't seen what this guy's, like, capable of completely. Also, do I gotta get down here? Hope I don't waste too much time. Yeah, I can't make that. I still lost, like, four minions. Not good, not good, not good. Should just stay in the lane. Ship lost minions for nothing there.
good. More longer drawn out fights are also good against Ringer, because he doesn't get too... Like, his W healing is like burst kind of healing, you know? I gotta get my W. He can just straight kill me here. Good. Okay. Oh, the healing is still too great. Fair enough. That pushes into me. Gives me a more decent wave spot. Let's get that anti-heal like ASAP. Ugh. I thought I could burst him down a bit there, but I was a bit too greedy. I should have tried to take like a turret shot or two and then get like a more juicy W out. But it's fine. We have our anti-heal. We should be good to go on trades after this. I'm going to just straight up rush Strybreaker because the soul is going to be so helpful, right? It's gonna curb his most beatable. And yeah, look, um, we already have a decent bit of an advantage here. Like, all the additional minions there are on the red side compared to the blue side are the minions we have, like, as a lead. He W'd out of it like mid air. Junglers. Cool. He's just gonna into Zinni. Cool. Yeah, I didn't think he could W out of it like mid air. I would have just kept it if I knew that. No, oh, happens. Not too detrimental, but it's not great that we died there. On the bright side, the wave was all the way up into like the turret, so we get to catch most of this farm. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. Pretty good trade. I was just greeting out there. That was a major chimp out. Ugh, I shouldn't have done that. If I just played him more patiently, I would have eventually gotten him. This was just too greedy. I mean, the wave's still decent for us. It's gonna push into us and all that good stuff, but... You know. It's better to get kills without dying. One for zeros and all that. Could I maybe try to like ult him out of the turret? I remember my first mm. fight. Let's see. I ran home crying to mama. She wiped my tears with her claws.
Ult out pretty kitty. I can get straight off of this here. Come on. Okay. Some things are happening down here. Alright. Let's recall. Pick up our straw breaker. Hmm, I'll just have to sell these D blade. Oh well, I mean Strat is a big enough of a purchase worth sacrificing the item over. Much. Is he going Gorge Drink here? Probably. I mean this is kinda like a Healy Rengar setup. I have to observe if he has life steal. Should be a bit more careful with the farm. Try to be a little bit fast. I don't like hurting people. I like the money I get from hurting people. <laughs> okay, he wasn't even in the bush. Okay. One trick you can do against Rengar is tank the minion wave and then drag it here. The larger the distance between him and the bush, between the bush and the wave, the more like, you know, out of position he is every time he jumps out. Ah, couldn't kill them both. That sucks. So Senar and these two. <clears throat> cool. Cool, cool, cool. What boots do I go? Let me think. I think I got Merc Treads here, but I don't really need it in lane, so... Yeah, no. Let's go for Shojin. <clears throat> Shojin, Sterax, Titanic Hydra. Like a move speed ability focus setup. Lots of CDR too. Like, Bork isn't terrible in this situation, but I feel like I gotta give priority to ability usage and also cooldown. <clears throat> Had to clear my throat there. Nice little quick combo there. for the other guy. I don't have the health for it. <laughs> nice. That was a good TP. Good job, good job. Let me just... Uh... Good job. Rengar can't ult me down here because he used ult back there before he died. Good. Let's finish our Merc Treads, then get um, more components for Shojin. Spear of the Shojin. 
What are these bozos doing here? Senna's prowling about. Hmm. Hmm. Good. <clears throat> they say you learn a lot from a beating. If that's true, I've made the whole world smarter. If you're throwing, throw it hard. Just keep pushing. <laughs> that was stupid. <laughs> he should have just W'd out. <laughs> Why would he eat that? Yeah. He was trying to mix it up, I guess. The thing is, the W has worked in helping him get away every time. So I don't know why this time he'd go for a different thing, but I don't know or care. I gotta get this quickly. Good. A little greedy. But Brand is dead, so there's no problem. Alright, let's stay near the U deer in case Ringer jumps on me. And Ringer's the only thing. Good. Let's get our Shoujin and get out of here. Ooh. A little stretch. Y'all know how it is. Gotta make sure I didn't pull nothing. <laughs> Is it too too soon for me to drop set quotes IRL? A wise master once be like water. Hmm. Yes, I'm kind He's ghosting. Alright. I'll go clear our top and then head down there to mid lane to help brute force this turret. After we're done with the, I feel so stupid. <laughs> I wanted to click out like the other side of it. Oh yeah, um after we're done with that, the game should just fall over. Like, the enemy team should fall over. I mean, they can't really offer any meaningful resistance as is, so... If we go for a nice roam play, that should be the coup de gras. For being like a fancy little silly billy. Nice mid turret. <clears throat> I got anti-heal, so I should be able to kill this Swain here. He's got a lot of health, though. Plant was conveniently in the way. Let's go back top, I guess. And yeah, the thing I just should add like a ton of damage to our kit, to our W. I remember my first fight. It's not tanking turret. Ah, I should just ulted. Should have just ulted. But then again, if I ult him, he can just jump to another minion and WW outright, so I don't think it would have changed much. If I can get on him without my base abilities. Like, ult is like the emergency in case he does jump, you know? Without it, because like, you know, without it, it's just not doable in terms of the chase. I guess I'm just perma-defending top mid, top mid. They're not going for it? Are they gonna get objective bounty from that? Hope not. If it like dies on its own. Yeah, I don't know. Our horde team's kinda just perish down there, so. I'd rather just go for this turret.
dude. I was balling there. Dude, I just crushed them so hard. Oh. <laughs> dude, we crushed them there. It's like putting down a resistance, you know? <laughs> Crush all descent. <laughs> Oof. So, how's the tyrannical Roku arc, huh? <laughs> yeah, ever since I started playing God King Garen, <laughs> things haven't been the same. <laughs> Oof. Alright, um... Let's uh, get our Tethering Kaisha. Can we group Baron? Maybe. Hmm. So Titanic? Styrax? Actually, no, I need the Death Stance too, no? Hmm. I'm not gonna sell the anti-heal. Fair enough, no Death Stance. Good, I'll be there. Buddy. Stop. Help us. Do it. Yeah, someone's gotta die. Rip. I feel like if I let him get even slightly close to the pit wall, he could just... Like, once he sends his abilities out, it's gonna be like a nightmare for us to claim the Baron, so... I decided... You know what? Better to die here. Not too bad, though. Should be fine still. Yeah, well, I've, I feel like every inventory slot with like the useful components, so like... <laughs> I straight up can't buy anything with this gold. L-M-A-O. L-M Mayonnaise. That should show how much damage is done, huh? Like, there's so many items that need damage counters straight up. They just straight up need damage counters. Also, why'd they remove the collector counter? Where it showed you how much gold you earned from it and stuff. Alright, Video Game Corporation. I like that better. Hi! Yeah, he's just shipped. <laughs> no point in me even going down there. He's straight up just gone. If I can get on someone here. So, too many of them. This is a little insane of them to even attempt to go for. Oh, they got off. Syndra survives. Nice. We get this wave here. Okay, let us recall. <coughs> You're right about that. Set me, boy. After the guy set me, boy. Yeah, I'm going Halbreaka. Give me even more move speed. With a stride, a mythic passive, that's like a 7% extra move speed I got, which... The percent being like 3.5 is roughly like 24-ish, I think. 25, more like. You are correct. <clears throat> <clears throat> I said I had her 
Um, let's go, boys. Do it. Let's see what you're made of. I guess I was standing there too menacingly. I swear, if Swain W steals this, I'm just gonna riot. Okay, I'm gonna lose my mind. Okay, the perfect angle, huh? Okay, <laughs> okay, that was trash for me. That was terrible for me. I should have just kept DPSing on the Swain to kill him first. I should have just kept hitting the Swain first, kill him, and then try to go for the rest. Yeah, that was trash for me. Oof, so bad. I think, dude, the sad part is if I just hit the W on like, like the center or something, should just be dead on the spot. Not the Twitch, because he's got Titanic Hydra. Got a boss. Got a boss. Yeah, boss, got it. Whatever you say, boss. Nice. Anti heal numbers. I'm gonna try to see if I can go for like a play or something. Should be able to. Just gotta land my abilities. Keep going. Keep on keeping on. Gotta keep the pressure up here. Alright, yeah, good. Some enemy team champions are caught out around the Baron, so this is definitely a, a good split. Should be able to just maul this turret. Is Twitch can't defend? Okay. Try to get the center with that straight W there. I'm just gonna get this bad boy. Twitch is out, Twitch is out, gotta run, gotta run, gotta run, gotta run, gotta run, gotta run. Ah, 
I, I live and test it too hard. I live and test it too hard. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, dude, I just bodied like a whole team. <laughs> They try to pull me out too, they try to save me. Oh my god, we just manhandled an entire team. Oof. Man. Left hook, right hook. Nice. Dude, I'm kind of liking Shoujin on set now. Like that move speed is no joke. Without that move speed, I'd be like dead already. I'd be like a long dead. And I feel like the advantage this kind of stride uh, Shoujin setup has over like a Gore Drinker one, where you go like Gore Drinker Titanic, is that although Gore Titanic or Gore any other item combination would do more damage and you'd heal more and you'd technically be more tanky, when you're up against ranged champions that can, 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 can kind of kite you, it's more important for you to actually be up in their face rather than you actually deal a lot of damage. Because it's like, imagine if I ult them in and I don't have stride. So they get slowed briefly because of the ultimate, but that's it. They can just walk away, right? We don't want that. We want to be able to just go in and finish them on the spot. And that, you know, three seconds slow is pretty huge for doing that. I'm just going to go end the game. Dude, 3k W damage is crazy. All right. I will see you boys in the next one. Peace out. All right, I'm back with some gameplay. I ran into some really horrifying issues with the display, so I couldn't get the early game in. Right, for some reason, League just moved into my like secondary monitor with a different aspect ratio, so it was just completely messed up, but I fixed it. So yeah, um, as a TLDR of what happened so far, I got ganked by Poppy. But I did like a flash W ignite to kill the Akali here, so it's all good. Hmm. Fair enough. Gonna be a bit easier to kill once I get ignite. <laughs> what what is wrong with <laughs> what? <laughs> like maybe if the poppy had a bit more health, that could have worked. But well, they didn't use any of their abilities properly at all. All right, we should be good. Got him! Got him, Chief! Not how you expected it to go, huh? Uh-uh. <laughs> Y'all know how it is, boys. Y'all know how it is. Oof. Homie came up to Pound Town and thought he was gonna leave in one piece. Yeah. Yeah, not happening. We do it the other way around. Mm. Like okay, let's keep on playing. Should be able to just run her down with the Diana here. Mm. Yeah, never mind. I don't like Diana just gave her a free jump with the shuriken. Should have dodged it. Or at least not gone until I was close enough to stop the Akali. I'm gonna go for a Strebrick Explosion setup. Worked very well for me last game, so might as well.
she does some damage. Does some damage, huh? Okay, fair enough. You better not take that. <laughs> Imagine if she took that. <laughs> I'm like, alright, is she insane enough to do this here? Alright. Let's recall. Let's recall. Big boys here. Dude, that was not going to go differently, buddy. That was not going to go differently. <laughs> Let's just keep farming and get our strap breaker. So we broke the mental of not one, but two people. Not one. Double meal deal. Can I get a double tilt meal deal, please? Not glad I wasn't even gonna fight there, I just wanted to recall, but Things he made me. Hmm. We really doing this, huh? Alright. Walk faster, fella. That's his flash gone. What's the Diana doing? Taste of my own medicine, huh? How about a taste of these fists, dog? Also, I hadn't realized that my jungle and AD swapped. So I just did the old switcheroo. Oh, 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 oh. Ah, dude, the Silas Chain CC plus the ult stopped me from ulting or using my W. That wasn't good. Ugh. <laughs> That's the stupidest thing I've typed in a solid while, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> I am not ashamed. We're right, time to uh crack some skulls. You're making it out in One Piece, Chief. Oh, I, I misranked that. Okay, let's get the turret here. Hmm. At least I got my plating, so that's good. They might go for me here again. They're gonna just straight up pay more attention to me top, so I gotta be careful. Alright, oh, she's blocked. Good. That didn't land? Oh, 
That's a turret down? Let's get it. Gotta be quick here. No muss, no fuss, no proxying or anything. Get the turret. Secure it. <clears throat> yeah, Shojin's a... Quite a pricey item. I'm going mid and steal some plates here. And some farm. Okay, Yasu just cooking. Akka just got a bunch of kills though, so... Let me get this. Alright! Good, good, good. It's a lot of gold there. Like, kill, turret, bunch of waves, kill, plus the wave, plus this wave. Like, we've generated a lot of gold in a very short amount of time here. I don't know if I can get Shojin in one life. Like, in one recall, I mean. But we can get pretty close. And honestly, if I greed, I should be able to. Just gotta make sure we don't get killed while greeting. Probably just died, so she's um, freed up to come top now. Mm, Kyle's just straight up fighting my team, though. I'm just silenting and growing, growing in power here, so I don't mind this too much. I'll get this turret. We'll, we'll try to. <clears throat> that gets here in time, right? Yeah, I have to move out there. They're not. Ah, not good. I got my Shoujin, but that's fine. Hmm, let me think here. What do I need to get? <sighs> we could also use the Hullbreaker early. Yeah, I'll go for it, I guess. I'll go for it. Um, we just die here? Alright, that sucks. I think I gotta help the team out more also. Just run around and crush a few fights. If I just let the fights go as they are, then they're, they're just gonna get um, folded. Which isn't conducive to a good victory experience. Hmm. I think I'll help down here. Might be a fight brewing. My fur just stood up. If you're throwing, Throw hard. Survive, sweetie pie. Dude, are you serious? She survived! Ugh, crowd control. Right. Gotta activate our full power! Because they're using the power of teamwork. It's just dead. Rip. Yeah, they're getting eaten up like nothing. This ain't good. Okay, Diana Gaming. I gotta start being cleaner now. Well, I sure could slow him. I 
try to get the Jin there. If I kept my strike slot, I might have been able to get to him. Oh well. If the W lands, he just straight dies there, though. Close. I don't know. Alright, nice. Good. He also should be okay. That's fine, too. Guess we're chilling. I'll sell my D shield and go for the. Actually, I'll just get the Ming Wing Hood. I was thinking I was just selling and go for the Phage, but. You know. <sighs> Not much difference. Okay, we're getting bodied. We gotta just work together. We're not grouped up at all, man. She just stayed in it. That sucks. Got flash soon. I just maybe find this gin alone. Being the boss is a lot better than not being the boss. You've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. No way, you just missed all that, dude. Whatever. Dude, she just lands that. We just kill them all there. Oh, she attacks someone else. She she all attacks someone else instead of the Jin. Dude, everybody just keeps messing things up. All right, I gotta just focus on the game. Keep my mind clear. <sighs> Gotta keep my mind clear. I have to get kills now, or else it's just doomed. Anywhere, anyone, anywhere. Kills, kills, kills. Let's see if I can farm on this Silos again. It's got ever far, so it's not gonna be as easy as before. Of course they have flash. Of course he has all the summoner spells, everything available. Of course. Should just ignite it. I mean he has a high, high bounty, so it was worth it to actually um, use summons for the kill. He got so not good. Seriously. Didn't have R. God. That sucks, man. At least we got some kills. Dude, I don't know what just... Uh, I keep getting kited out in every single situation. It's not good. Gotta stop playing like a monkey for sure. It's just... I don't know. I'm trying to force place here. And it's like... If I just kind of... 
I don't know. I gotta just land on my stuff, actually. Be more careful. Okay. Nice! Good, good, good. What do you mean? Got a Baron. Baron, 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 Baron. Baron! Okay, one person can do that, there's can Baron. Oh my god. You've gotta be kidding me. Oh, God. And Fair enough. Let's get our Hydra. Get that W damage to beef, beef up. It's gonna kill you. They're gonna kill you. Yeah. Try to warn you. Try to warn you. Oh. Never Too hairy for humans. What are you gonna do? See if I can kill the house again. Nothing people hate more than a guy who makes what yours is mine. Of course, she has flash too. God forbid I get into a fight where they don't have everything at their disposal. Dude, like, what? Are they seriously fighting non-stop and they only have to flash against me? Alright, that should be a poppy kill for free. Never mind, never mind. Oh, alright, let's just hope they don't get bodied here. Oh my god. Never oh my god. Alright, I guess we kinda did okay there. Just I just wish we killed the poppy too. Then it would have been really worth it. Yeah, I can't deal with the Akali on this level in health. I'll be there. Like, at this HP, Akali can just one combo me, so I'd rather recall first. <sighs> Dude, that was crazy close. Man, that was crazy close, but we just popped them like balloons. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. I'm not gonna lie, I'm tempted to start playing set with Ghost. <laughs> Honestly, I might try it next game. Like, if I'm up against, like, a Kaidi team again, I'll try it next game. Why isn't the Baron started? Oh my god. Hmm, face rush.
good. Yeah, we can kind of go for it. I'll get the poppy out of the way. Nice! Sorry, Vayne just popped off there. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. Link him in Titanic Hydra. Clear out top. That was good stuff from the Vayne. Alright, everyone's popping off now. Everyone's popping off. That's good. Got our mojo back, finally. Good. Just chilling and farming. I think I'll go for a Sterax last item. Get that bit of burst resist. Death Dance maybe even. Ah, they saw me. Let's try. They ain't gonna do nothing, boy. I'll just keep the wave baron up. We gotta just keep him busy until the vein can get stuff done. Okay. Vein got killed. Dude, th that stuns, right? Uh, I hate Poppy so much. Oof. Oh, it's okay. You can just be anywhere except here, 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 here. Like what? Do I just stand here? Ugh, that was annoying. Man, I, I should have played it better. I should have played it better. Yeah, I should have just gone for kills. I think at this point... Instead of just going for the right W, I should just go for any sort of beneficial W. Because there I was like, alright, I'm just gonna use the W to like one shot the Yukali here. But if I just use the W to kill the Poppy or the Nami or just for this shield, that would have let me survive longer to then think something, like, th think of something, right? Like, I see the Poppy's trying to, like, dash onto me. I activate my W then, right? Like, like this, right? Hits the Yukali, hits her too. Kills her instantly, gives me the shield so they can't press me down. Can survive against the Akali longer, her shroud is over, E into punch punch strike, like, like, there's a lot I could have done there. So yeah. A lot I should have done there. I guess I'll just stick to the side lane then. More difficult for them to kill me. Look at the rodents. <laughs> Come here, doggy. Come here, doggy. Come here, doggy. Uh-oh, let's go get this turret then. It's 
W two K. All right. I don't like hurting people. I like the money I get. <sighs> this one's getting annoying. Kali's constantly just getting kills. She actually killed her. Wow. Nice. Yeah, I'm just tearing through the base here. What is that moose speed, dog? He just sprinted out of Mach 10. GG. I'll see you guys next one. Peace out. All right, we're back to the gameplay. We're up against uh, York Top. Not the most difficult matchup, but we gotta just be careful of his abilities because if he is able to get his ENW on us, then it can basically lead to him just straight up killing us. But the thing is, our double auto attacks makes it a bit easier for us to break his uh, wall. <laughs> that worked. That worked. Um, <laughs> just straight up cheese killed him. I messed up my auto attacks so badly there too, if you guys noticed. Like I just kept like eating them. Just uh, I guess I'm just used to the lethal tempo there. Also, I'm surprised he doesn't just TP back and get the lane advantage here. Whatever. Works for me. But yeah, due to set having twice the number of attacks as normal champions, the cage isn't as bad as usual, and also we could always just blitz him with our W. Ult is also great because York is kind of like Ilawi in that him and his ghouls and his maiden kind of locks an area down, the area that they inhabit, right? But if you ult him, you're also ulting him away from the, the ghouls and the maiden so they can't help him anymore, right? So in a way, you're kind of just getting away from the damage and you get like a pretty nice opportunity to just put him down. All right, he got to the lane earlier because we killed him, which gives him time to, you know, stack it up like this. That, that was in range. He auto attack like the, the sky. <laughs> okay. Let's farm up. Yeah. Hmm, maybe I shouldn't have gone for that he has TP. I should just tell I should just farm calmly instead of trying to fight him. Not the good outcome here. No tapping out. Uh. If I had lethal tempo, I would just kill him there, though. <sighs> yeah, this might be a lethal matchup. Oh. Good. I got my ignite up soon. Dude, I swear, that, that Q range is crazy. That Q range is insane. How does that even land? What, the increase or something? Oh, God. We got junglered. Fun. Let's go Bork then. Gonna need that extra auto attack power to slap this guy down.
close. Nice. I got most of the CS. That's good. Missed a few. Should be able to kill him more easily once I get my ultimate. So that when he like puts us in the cage and leaves, we can just kinda ult after him. Oh I hate this about Yorick so much. If you queue an R attack on him and he has his cage in front of you, the R attack automatically goes in the cage instead of on you on him. <sighs> Such a stupid bug. Yeah, if they fixed all the bugs in York's shit, he'd be like, unplayable. Okay, should be able to kill him here. He's not gonna stay easy. What's that ward? Good. I was gonna proxy here. <clears throat> Block him off. He's gonna get his uh, maiden. Okay. <sighs> Kinda need the health too, but fine. Gotta get on the turret to farm. Mm. Not good. I gotta ult up soon though. If I can catch him with a stun, I might be able to ultimate my turret. And his ghouls will just trigger the turret aggro. Glad I don't have to fight me. Okay. Can you just hold them off a bit more? Ah, that sucks. Well, he tried. At least he got the ghost. Mm, I'll try to see if I can one combo him here. I'm dead. Yeah, it sucks. Not the best. It is what it is. Let me see here. To continue with Bork, I think so. It's just way too invaluable to give up. Hmm. Wave should be in a decent spot for us too now. So that's good. Pushing in. Also get our ignite up, so if he gets a bit too testy, we can knuckle him down. Hey bro, you hungry for a knuckle sandwich? Kablam! Dude, how does he have so 
Dude, did he just complete his boost? Yeah, he has boots advantage, so he can just outrun me. I'm gonna go with Swifties, I don't care anymore. Like, him just running away from me like that really just tilted me. Also, the Nocturne's here again. Like, I wouldn't just go in to die there if he wasn't there, but I was like, might as well, because he's just gonna kill me, isn't he? Also, just completely missed my W there, which sucked. Oh no, he's gonna mouth breathe on my turret. Rip. If I ever find my own now, well, I hope he's been training. Okay. Hopefully the moose becomes in handy. Yeah, we're kind of in a bit of a weak spot right now. As we build up to our Bork, until we get it, we won't be seeing a lot of strength. But once we do have it, pow, you know. Nice. Okay. I think we get it next recall, but for now we, we gotta just make do with what we got. Thank you. I'll take that. I'm dead. Oh, God. Oh, okay, good. We're in the clear. We gotta recall anyway. He's gonna keep back. Yeah, Bork is gonna be super huge here. That slow is so useful on its own. Like, it just like puts him in position for moral attacks. Mm -mm. Good. Gonna pair it up with a Starburger too. And then we should be just cooking with the gas. Yeah. Only moves we against champions in his vision, I think. Not just in general, like global. <laughs> like like Warwick W or something. This is the cost of greed. Good. Not gonna lie, this guy's not a bad York player. Like, the things he's doing are annoying me, but he's low-key quite effective at just wasting time. He's a bit, like... If he, like, played a bit more passively... Like, the whole kiting thing is perfect. But he just goes in without his, like, wall sometimes, right? And that just gives me openings. If he only played like that when he had his wall up, then, you know, I'd have very low amount of openings in general. But so far, not bad. Not bad. Not enough, obviously, but still. I like a good fight. Violence is my business. And business is Violence is my business. And business is a boomin'. Oh, my W! They killed me in the air. They killed me in the air, dude. That damage would have been crazy good. That damage would have been crazy good. And the shield, too. I would have just... Okay, never mind. Let's just, <laughs> Let's just clean them up like that. Good enough. Good enough. My role is uh, chosen. I am chosen. My role is chosen. All right, let's get our Strybreaker and then build that into like um, I think a cleaver could work well. So, Give him that crunching power. Let's get our all attacks to be as powerful as possible. Know what I'm saying? Nah, mean. Nah, me from League of, League of Legends. In. <laughs> so unfunny. 
so just like not funny at all. <laughs> just barely a statement. B barely qualifies as a play on words. God, okay. Oh, he's going Iceborne. Get out of my sight, bro. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> Dude, oh my god. We just vaporized him. Who's I think I think the FF vote from the enemy team got displayed to us. <laughs> Cause we're so far ahead. Uh is uh Sindra coming over here? Hmm? I'll chill around a bit still. Should probably, like, stuck the turret. To destroy the curse, I use it. Hmm. I should have probably gone like that and ulted him into a wall. That would have worked. That's what I was trying to do, but I kind of misangled that and ulted him into the... A range. Not precise enough. Strat should help us greatly with that though. Just maneuvering and stuff. Fair enough. Fair enough. We're not doing terribly. Not doing terribly at all. Maybe we go Titanic Hydra and then Cleaver, huh? Cause like a Shoujin at the end too. Oof, get the stack up that W damage. Like Shoujin gives you so much like stats. 55 AD, 500 health. That it's actually really good for W damage. It's like, I think the second best W damage enhancer, aside from like... Like just Titanic Hydra. And Titanic Hydra specifically works with HP. So you're getting like... 65, 70, 80, 500 health. Right? By the end of the game. But this is like the second best, like by far. Also, it gives a ton of CDR too, so that's great. I must expected his buggy wall to absorb my second punch there. Get that money. <laughs> Just right click like crazy. Hit the York, not the wall. Someone hold my coat. Good. Man, Titanic Hydra Wave Clear is going to be so nice. Maybe I'll go for Shoujin early and then Titanic second. Because we don't have that much health stack, right? sucked. They kited me too hard. Also, because I didn't see the Nocturne anymore, I couldn't aim my W. Hmm. Not great. Not great. <laughs> That's a pretty good chunk of change. Almost 100 extra damage. It's like 80. More like... Yeah, like 70 damage. Pretty good, pretty good. Once I get the HP and the AD though, oof, like once I finish this, the 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 boost up in AD for the W damage. Oh, not the AD, the, the, the damage boost for the W is gonna be crazy. Alright, let's get back up top. Look at these numbers, bro. Hmm.
I should have hit the wave, I guess, but I think, she, like, I think the Maiden, like, teleports with him, regardless of whether she is in combat or not. I'll see the turf here real quick. Oh my god, the minions are in the perfect position to just annoy me. Alright, let's just do this. This way. Have it your way. <gasps> Have it your way! Welcome to BK. How may I serve you today? One flame broil. <laughs> Have it your way. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all know what I'm referring to. Alright, GG. See you guys next one. Peace out. Oh, we're back some gameplay. We're up against Darius Top. I'm down here helping the team out to, you know, help us take care of shackle boxes. Just harassing him and all. If you can get like a coordinated team going, a thing you can do to inconvenience shackle a little is basically just go and um, trigger his boxes so that he can't get them for his first clear. Like it's not like a like a game winning thing, right? But if you're not gonna kill you, you know, if you're not gonna get a kill, you might as well just, you know, ruin his clear a bit, make it a bit slower, all that good stuff. Anyway, Darius top now set is actually a pretty good champion, Darius, but you gotta just be a little careful of his ghost, right? The thing is, Darius doesn't beat you, but ghost beats you. Okay, so the number one ability that we have to use properly is our W, okay? Our W is the only thing that stops Darius from just being able to straight up kill us. There he is. Yeah, that was insane for him. <laughs> Honestly, I was just straight up killed him by myself there anyway. Because once he tanks that W, I still have that shield to let me flash in and get two all attacks off. But, whatevs. I'm gonna play slow. Right? Still not have my flash. So if I get level 3 off of the wave, I should be able to kill him again. Fair enough, let's leave. If I save my E, I might have been able to get another kill there, but this is fine as well. Just keep the kill, pack it up, shop with it. Let's get the AD. Yeah, as I was saying, um, before I was so really interrupted, <laughs> you gotta use your W to just try to hit Darius with it, right? Obviously you gotta use it against anyone, but it's especially useful in this lane because Darius is all in, does a crazy amount of damage, but our W works as like a burst to just like put him down when he's low health, right? So that's where we're using our W for, as like an execute of sorts. And the thing about Set is that he's so stat shaky that if we do land our W, we can just straight up kill him in like a normal all in. So yeah, that's essentially our goal here. Now, one more thing that's really important in this lane is Ignite. Right, we gotta get like good cooking done with Ignite here. Darius is at his most dangerous when he's low health, which is why Ignite is like so perfect because it essentially just, he just doesn't exist at low health, he just dies. Back off. Huh. Not good to tank Qs. I wanted to kind of slow the push down so I could maybe do something against him, but it's not possible. It's fine. We get our Ignite back up. Ignite is on a lower cooldown than Ghost, so... We have like a 30 second window to kill him. Good. Let's play the lane. Play the push out. Should wait for the minion attacks, my bad. My coat costs more than this whole damn place. 
Now we can use our E to dodge his Q. I don't really quite recommend doing that earlier on because we needed to like guarantee our W, right? I'm just fighting here because we have the minions, right? It's like a no-brainer fight. Okay. Oh my god! Uh junglers. Yeah, that sucked. We almost got him there. He lived by just like a tiny bit of health. Alright, let's get Tobbies. Their full team is just auto attack AD, so this thing is going to be killer useful. Yeah, we just got messed up by the jungler, man. Yeah. Ugh. Well, it is what it is. Darius's ultimate is more useful in this lane than our ult, though, so that's something we got to be a bit careful of. That's his ghost gone, I'll take it. Bro, what? Given how important ghost is to him in this lane, I'll take that. We gotta play quite carefully though. Right now, bad W usage can just literally cause us to die because basically speaking if we don't kill him with w or at least get him close to like dying with a few next auto attacks then what can happen is um he just kites us around with his move speed and stuff lands some cues and then puts us down with his ultimate his ult is better than our ult in the 1v1 okay so i gotta just be careful of that and shaka just killed the bye that lands all right Good trade. Straight if you can dodge Darius's Qs like consistently, it's always good to get like good trades off against him. Because his healing is worse than ours. Survive just barely again. Seems we're gonna have to just go Bork. He just keeps like getting away barely with his life. We'll see. Let's see if we can get a play at least from this. <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> I'll take the kill. Uh, Shaco's just gone crazy, isn't he? Does he have all the kills on his team? Yeah. <laughs> just noticed. Also, this is not a good idea because Shaco's just gonna come and take it the second he sees it. Woo! Great. Did that leave a mark? I'll get that. I mean, it's the same components for both of them. Some still rated the course correct. But essentially, if Darius is still putting up a fight, you gotta go for like a like a Bork. Bork just completely destroys him. But if you've already won lane, then you could just go, just go Stride Breaker. And because you've won lane, the slow from Stride is enough to hold him together for you to kill eventually. Whereas Bork is more so for like just brute force killing him, right? Dude, this guy has like almost died three times already. Like, what is this?
finally. I don't get the plating. Ugh. Fine. The minions will just have to do. Okay. Guess we're going Stripebreaker. Don't need the uh, extra damage from Bork. We already beat him. Now that we've won, Stride should just make kills even easier for us because we can now just freely engage with our E and then use our Stride Breaker to keep him in place to like stick to him and like dodge his Qs. As set, once you get level 6, you can basically just dodge his Q forever by first engaging with E to dodge the first Q and then using your ultimate to dodge the second Q, right? Now doing it like that makes it so that you won't be able to time your Ws correctly, so... I don't know. I feel like it just just do what like works, honestly. Dodge his Qs, mash his face. I knew that was enough for him to kill me. <laughs> kind of like hooked each other at the same time. Uh. Well, buddy, you snooze, you lose. It's not bad. It's just a bit careless. Also, you you don't go <laughs> sorcery into uh, Seth. <laughs> You have to go bone plating. We well, don't have to go bone plating, but basically speaking, bone plating makes your life so much easier into set because if he hooks you in for like a trade, you can basically just like, as as Darius, I mean, just RWQ and walk away, and you win that trade because of bone plating, right? And if you're up against Darius, I feel like against Darius, as any champion, bone plating just does wonders because Darius has lower range than basically everyone. Like unless you're playing like the one two champions that have lower range than Darius even, but. Darius has lower range than basically anybody, so that means that um, the times where he will get damage off on you are only the times where like um, like he gets on top of you for like a trade, right? So it's like as long as you're not eating free Qs, that doesn't count, obviously, right? Those are dodgeable as long as you're not predictable, but yeah. Bone playing just makes your life so much easier because he has one more extra thing to peel off before killing you. So if you're like playing a like a Renekton or like a Seth or something, right? It's like a Pretty huge pickup. Hmm. I should have just ulted him out instantly. Would I be able to kill him then? I'm not sure. I think he warded the bush like that. Shouldn't have W'd, I could've used it to actually execute him right now. Okay. Let's get a turret here. He just left. He's playing good now. Too bad, it's not enough. Waiting for the shake, are we? Of course. I understand. Oh, the line of people trying to take me down just ain't long enough. Do we have a jungler? Or better, that's worth it. <laughs> oh, no, it's not! Okay. <laughs> a little knuckle sandwich there. Got him with that uppercut. Nice. Good 
good. See, if you guys saw what I did there, I used Strybreaker. Like, because I wasn't sure which one was the real one, right? So I used Strybreaker because it dealt the same damage to, like, both of them. And whichever took the least damage was the real him. <laughs> Not gonna lie, he committed to the roll a bit harder than he should have. But it doesn't matter. Alright, we gotta get out of here. <laughs> Dude, how long can he stay in that? God, Yone. Dude, Yone E is the dumbest ability in the game. Straight up. Straight up, no cap, fam. Alright, Bork should be super huge. If I had Bork in this situation, I would have just made cat food out of them. Just grinding them to dust with my fists. So, yeah. The enemy team has got some good stuff to look forward to. Let's just put it that way. I'm gonna go for a Shoujin next. Gotta stack up my W damage in a spike, but we don't have a lot of health, obviously, so you can't just go for Titanic. I mean, we can, but like, show just. Okay, so how do I explain this? I think base level, Titanic Hydra does give like, um. a bit more W damage than Shojin, but it's only a bit more, because that extra AD is like. It's usually like 25-ish, right? And then it gets to 30, 35, and that's where it kind of stops, depending on your build, right? That's the amount of bonus AD you get from Titanic Kajra. Now, the thing is, 60 AD, 500 HP, is more than 55 AD and 500 HP. But Titanic Kajra gives you wave clear, and Shojin gives you move speed and a ton of ability haste, right? So what, like, and also it works doubly well for, like, your W. It's not a CC spell, so it gets, like, the full sort of, um... Like the Dragon Force passive. Like it's half for CC, but W's not CC, right? So yeah. Um, we get a ton of ability haste with our uh, Shojin. Which is why it's like, not only gives us a ton of W damage, but it also gives us a lot of um, ability haste. I don't know, I was just confused here. Who's coming in? Where is the enemy? Huh? Of course, his ultimate, whatever, E. Most broken ability in the game. Well, one of. Straight rolls. All men want to be me. Too bad they ain't me. I should have just, like, been more careful. Dash away now. Too hairy for humans, too smooth for Biscay. What are you gonna do? <laughs> Back for round two, big boy. Ooh, let's do this, let's do this, let's do this. Ah, the Shaco! God. I hate teamwork, man. I hate teamwork. <laughs> it's fine. I'm such a physical beast. Such a monster that they have to use teamwork, right? They have no choice. Poor enemy team. They don't use teamwork. I just kill them all. Just, just, <laughs> it was so funny because he just saw him and just kept talking to himself and like ran off like those schizo thing ever. 
<laughs> nice glove, Ezreal. Maybe he <laughs> just, just keeps talking to himself. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Darius, he's as crazy as the as the rest of us, huh? Hmm. Bro, what? Sup, bro. Sup, bro. All right, let's just keep battering down this turret. I should have actually just gone bot and killed the, well, everyone. That's probably the wiser choice. Pop. What a nice little coinky dinks. What a nice little coinky dinks. Him in that bush. I should have just gone for that. I was like, alright, I got enough for Shoujin. Seemed to be off by a uh, little. We can make up for it though. Oh my god. They use teamwork again. Also, white. <laughs> yeah, he did a lot of magic damage despite going like AD and having 30 AP. And I know that he does magic damage with just like, like his blighted quiver, but you know, this thing, his ult. Whatever. Right, let's get down here. this one. Alright, they got him. We gotta run down here. Make sure this boy doesn't get more than what he deserves. Uh, might go a little breaker for fun. Got Baron, nice. And I woke up. I mean, I, I respawned for Baron too. So that's perfect. Darius! What do you think you're doing? What are they going to do, Ma? Get back here! We gotta hunt Darius down. Come on, man. There's just four on me. I gotta play back. I gotta start playing back. They're just straight up sending everyone out at me. Okay, the team's just strong enough to just brute force win on their own. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> yeah, Darius get back in there for seconds. Died instantly. I just should have aced them there. Holy, that's one, two, four. That's me. I want three. Where did the other two die? Oh, he almost dead there. The four are dead here. Okay. Nice solo kill. I mean, we're not really doing that much caring, honestly, here. We've just been brawling for fun the whole time, essentially. Like, we are the strongest guy on the team and on the map, but, you know, <laughs> we're not really using that strength productively, okay? We're not exactly being productive with that strength. Eh. That's what it is, though. Don't care. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. 
Run, set, run. Nothing I hate more than people with sleeves. You guys hate fireworks too. <laughs> Call me crazy, but I absolutely hate fireworks. <laughs> There's no way to just tank that W from me like that. There's no way. <laughs> and the FF3, I see what this next one piece out. Alright, we're back from gameplay. We're up against Gangplank Top. This one's a little rough. Um, I'm trying out Ghost in this lane to see how well it works. I feel like if I can keep up with him better with Ghost, and I can also, like, um, if I can kind of just dodge his barrels better. It should make up for the fact that I don't have Ignite or Teleport, and also Ghost will be quite nice into this team in general. But, we'll see how it goes in lane, right? He's running Teleport, which makes things a, little, a bit better for us. Here an E. Not good to get hit by all that, but it's not a terrible trade. They have a bit better sustain, so I don't mind all that actually. Not too much, at least. Ha. Actually, got out of the range of that. Sucks. Come on, dog. He's got his orange now. Can't cheese him. Oh, that's a bit more damage. He's ooh, he should just leave right now. Or soon at least. If I surf around his turret properly, I think we're in the clear. Hmm. What was that dodge, boys, huh? <laughs> How was that little little juke there? Woo! Man. Yeah, that was close. Thankfully, because Gangplank is a totally fair champion. He's got 1k gold. Like, he legit just outfarmed us there, despite us getting a whole assist gold. He just generates gold by existing. You gotta love champs like that, right? Just. It's gold. Why? We're playing the game normally. Whatever. I mean, to be fair, we played it as well as we could have. Maybe I could have stolen a kill or two there myself, right? Or if I held the the W, could have killed the Nidalee as well. I don't mind it though. Every single one of them thinks they're the one to beat me. <laughs> okay. Hmm. 
Every single one of them thinks they're the one to beat me. Of course he cheeses using the bush. Loving that interactive gangplank laning experience. I have counterplay here, by the way. God, just straight up nothing I can do. Uh, Range me, puts a barrel down. That's it. Come on, dude. What's wrong with my CSing now? Okay. <laughs> what are the junglers doing up here? There we go. Oh, perfect. She really thought she was the only one who could pull stuff like that, huh? Bro, I got that dog in me, you know what I'm saying? Hmm. We got R now on her. Nice. Let's get this wave here. Not a huge fan of sharing all this with a Vi, but I guess she worked for the kill. Deserves some of the gold. Gonna strike her for Starbreaker. Desperately needed this lane. Also, boots wise, I'm thinking. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna go for Merc Treads then. <laughs> for now, nothing, obviously. Eh, let's go with that, yeah. Nothing for now, but the greedy part of me wanted to go for a Swifties. Right, just so I could better like easily catch him and kill him. But I feel like that it's not going to change too much. I can just kill him on the cooldown on my ghost, and I'd better just either get armor in terms of tobies for these two, or merc treads against her. That'd be the more rational thing to do. He almost has essence reaver, dog. Jesus. He actually dodged that. Well played. No, well played enough. Okay, I'm out of here. Not dealing with all this. Mm -mm. And he froze it. Ugh. Let's get that Tobbies. Does he freeze it? That would be the smart thing to do. Just keep it under service for as long as possible. Yeah, he's just hardcore hitting everything. Okay. I'm fairly certain if Vi keeps her ultimate until after he oranges, she just solos him. He did that for Essence Reaver. Yeah, he did. Let's try to proxy then. I gotta be careful with my ultimate. He can just orange out of it in the middle of it, so I gotta use it like at the very end.
Nice free plating here. Can I get the proxy on him? Nope. Let's get the plating. Oof. Well, he's 0 3. He surely deserves that damage. Surely. Ah, that sucked. Too much bull. Should have waited for my W. Oh no, he got the bounty kill. That means he's gonna be able to finish another whole item. Because Gangplank's economy isn't completely broken. <laughs> like, I don't know, man. He just gets gold for free. Like, he finished his item before I did, man. Like, that's, that's just... Like... Like, when you're 0 3, there's no world you should be able to do that. And it's not like he has a huge CS lead on I me. Mean, if it's like, okay, he's 0 3, but he's got like 40 CS up on me, whatever, right? Or 20. But it's literally the same CS, 0 3 finishes this before I do. And it's like, if you just add the gold up, it's not even like that much of a lead, right? Because it's just like this minus 350 versus what I had at the time, which was just. Um. Let's see. 1.1, 1.1, 2.2, 2.6, then 2.9, yeah. Let's wait for him to walk up a bit more. He actually gets to soul kill me there. Should've gone more for the barrels. God, I hate this champ so much. It's just that gold, man. Oh well, it's fine. I did lose a bunch of health to the minions there, which kind of changed things. I'd say things are going well. Jungle's doing fine. Mid's doing great. Bot's surviving. Samir's still a problem, and she can actually get a very good team fight off into her team, but we do have enough stuff to kind of just ruin her. She has cleanse, but we have like, like Vi, me, Morgana. We have so much for her to deal with. Okay, that lands. The flash gone. Probably shouldn't have worn my nice pants to this. That's his TP gone too, All right? But Nidalee's here. That was close. <sighs> Thankfully, we heal at like a crazy rate as set. There should be a free kill for the boy. Get out of here, doggy. Get out of here, doggy. Woo! 
<laughs> that one actually hit me. Okay, rip. Let's go all the way back. That was close. That was close. Okay, let's go for a... Uh, I guess a, sh a Shoujin then. Alright, let's go. I'll get down here in case I'm needed. We got ghosts, we should be able to just crunch this fight down. Oh my god, her dragging the wave actually helped GP out. Uh, I think it's worth it though, to help get these kills. <laughs> what? Oh, then Nidalee survived, like, just barely. Oh, that was bad. I <sighs> only got one kill out of that. Is my that sucked. The W hit her, too. She just barely survived. Alright, let's get the turret, then. I'm surprised they didn't just go all in on me there. Gotta keep my E for that Samira. Are they gonna go in on me? Come on. Yeah. Ah, I almost blew her up there. Ugh. I almost blew her up. If I didn't lose that initial amount of HP, I might have been able to just straight kill her there. Got a little too greedy. Oh well. Oh well. Have to temper that a bit. I think after Shoujin, I'm gonna go straight into Titanic just to get my W damage as like just high as possible. Then maybe even like a like a cleaver or something, just get crazy high W damage. Cause I'm in the mood to just you know make people pop. I mean, it, like you could make the argument that hey, if we wanted that, just go hard steel Bork. But honestly, like, like Gorjinker, but. I feel like Strawberry is just should have necessary to survive in some matches. It's, it's just you just can't play without it. Okay. Let's get the wave here. I have Shojin coming up. Yeah, I kind of grieved that. If I knew the Jace was there too, <laughs> I would have just not even walked up. I was like, okay, fine, I'll just one shot the summer here, but no. He messed my expectations up. All right, let's just chillax. I feel like we're just running in and dying over and over again into like 1v whatevers. So I gotta play a bit more back and play with the team. Ah, my favorite thing to do, relying on people. Cool, right? I'm gonna go for this bad boy and then Titanic. Ooh. Give me that HP slash AD boy. Give me that W damage boy. Ka chunk. 960. Not a, not, not a bad amount, but 
not nearly the amount I want it to be. Not nearly the amount. Okay. Not a good death. This what it is, though. Just the Morgana. Let's try to get in here. I think with the Vi and me, we should be able to take these two. Jin's here too, but... Not here. Okay, this one's a bit rough. Gotta just ghost in here. Dude, my W! Uh, I was smashing it. Dude, how long? Like, why did it take me so long to catch up to her there? Whatever, man. I guess Ghost is just not, you know, the thing, huh? I don't know, man. I was just sprinting and it wasn't enough. That's a free kill, isn't it? She just. One shot the Morgana. Cool. Not a disgusting champion at all. I swear, if your champion scales, there should be trash in lane. <laughs> no, if your champion scales that well. Okay. Um, I gotta be there when Vi starts the fight, essentially. Like, if I was there when she ulted the Samira, she's dead. Right? What is this? Okay, that's her ult gone at least. Yeah, I'm not gonna 2v1 again. Willingly. The thing is, if I just let the Leona catch me there and the Egan show me, I'm pretty sure they kill me before this guy even presses the black shield key on our keyboard. Okay, we got the Vi here. I got a flank. Thought I was gonna go in, man. Are we gonna engage or something? Okay, cool. Engage here, engage here. Let's just watch them do nothing then. Ari could engage, Vi could, but all right. Just can, all of you can just die here alone. I have, I'll go make sure we don't lose the game. I don't get why we don't just engage from either of those two angles. Or right, he TP'd down. Like we, Vi doesn't engage, Ari doesn't engage. It's just so so stupid. Let's just get in here, I guess. He lived? How did he live? I thought that hit was enough. Alright, whatever. I got the center at least. Yeah, I did not expect him to live there. Whatever. Yeah, this match is just so doomed. Dude, if we just engage there, like, the person going in would just die, mind you. But because Samir is trapped there, Vi can just straight ult her, and then we, I can get on her and kill her like that. And then once the Vi is dead, we can just sweep up with the rest of them, right? It was just like such a... like a slam dunk of a teamfight win. It was just like gave up, basically. Just to like... <laughs> mess around with, against a team who has higher poke than us. You know? Like their, their poke is better range than us. They have a pretty good poke comp, actually. Jesus. He's got eight up there, huh? 
But yeah. Since we're playing against this kind of comp, our objective is to just start the fights and try to win them quickly. Like if things drag on, we're just doomed. Dude, how is she behind me? Actually, like, we're just there. Ugh. Man. Honestly, if they. <laughs> it's kind of stupid, but I'm pretty sure they could just. Like, they went around, right? Like, if I was not there and they had this territory, couldn't they have just done Baron? Like, is that crazy? I don't know. I feel like... I mean, because all of us are bot lane, right? And no one's up here, so they could pretty easily get the Baron, given that their AD is quite fed. Alright. <laughs> Quick as a fox! Oh, great. Aw, oh, great. Let's get in here. Bro, they just kill me through my W shield. Rip. Also, I thought I ult a bit earlier than I actually did. This one's so doomed. I'm not playing well. They also have a very high range team, which I kind of need help in getting to. Like, their range is way too high for me to like actually just keep up with, so I can't just like do my thing without flash. Without Flash, we're just kind of useless against this team. I mean, the thing is, we have Vi and, like, Ari, who are theoretically set up, right? And Vi is pretty good setup, but it's just like... Like, why don't we get any of this action when I'm there and alive, you know? <laughs> like, if I'm there when that's happening, oof! Like, you know. Time to, time to eat. Time to tuck in. Just gotta time my movement better, I guess. Get punch drunk. Heads. Okay, let's go get a Titanic. Let's see what like the difference is with just Titanic. Like just a completion of everything else done. 1251 and 1396. Nice. Pretty good, given that we had most of the stats already. Okay. Thinking Sterics next then. Not Hull Breaker. We're going to get a lot of good AD from this. Okay, everyone's just there. So, <laughs> can't walk up. It's not bad that we're racing for a dragon though, but it's like we're just giving up the position. We're basically letting them take over this area, so they have a better fight essentially than us. Also, I gotta go defend top. Well, let's see how quickly he kills us. My alarm just went off. Slam dunked, bro. That's a pretty decent kill, given that he's ahead of me now. But the team gets wiped. Ah, oh, the dilemma. Do I stay with the team, carry the team fight, do I go side lane and take care of the split push? The age old top laner sort of quandary. Oh my god, Dude, did they even do any damage? Why are they all so high health? <laughs> I 
<laughs> Alright, I, I th I'll take that. That's a pretty good kill. Their jungler's gone. If the Viking can get there, she can just steal it. Nice! Dude, we saved the Baron. Nice. We did it. We did it. Okay, okay. Starting to be more helpful now. I'm liking it. Okay, no, they're, they're both gonna get him killed, aren't they? Uh... Bro, help each other! Don't let him kill them more! Okay, just get out of there. She should have just watched the GP kill the... He's gonna solo the... God, these humans! She just should have let the GP kill the... Oh my god! Okay. Bro! She got lucky there too. That was perfectly smiteable. <laughs> Just fumbled the bag with the dash. Uh. <sighs> Come on. Alright, whatever. Okay, good kill. Okay... Getting a little dicey. Careful! She's dead. Okay, rip. Okay, man. How did he die? Alright. Low key, I didn't play that well, but I'm not gonna say that any of these guys <laughs> particularly played that well either. It is what it is. Just lost as a team. GG. I'll see you boys in the next one. Peace out. Oh, right, we're back from gameplay. We're up against Trundle Top. This one is a rough one. Trundle is a very brute force kind of brawly matchup. He kind of just um, runs over you and spams you with his auto attacks, so it's a very stat checky lane. Now, Set is one of the champions with enough meat to actually fight back, but like the most crucial thing is our usage of our W, okay? If we let him get hit by like an edge of the W or like let him like let him dodge it completely, then we're basically just dead, right? Trundle's DPS is not something we can actually match, so we really need that burst damage from our W to just finally put him down. Like, that bit of HP damage that we gotta do is really, really, really important, right? The shield is also great, so W usage is key in this matchup. I went for Lethal Tempo, um, Bone Plating, and also Ignite to give me as much fighting power as possible. I hope he challenges me here, level 1. We'll see how hard he, um commits to the fight if he goes in like just to poke a bit i might just go for like a q and just like poke back but if he goes all in i will just mash his face and rank my w to blast him with that but yeah the teleport is a bit of a problem so let's hope we're not too low hp from this fight All men wanna be me. Too, too bad they ain't me That's good enough. That chill a bit. Mama always said I had her Once W is up again, I'll go for a kill when he tries to see us. There we go. 
He overestimated his tankiness. Must be a fight brewing. Perfect. Okay, let's recall here. Gonna go for a Bork. Hmm. Might just get the pickaxe out right. Just straight up get the AD. Blow him up even more. Hmm. Personally, should have gone for a vamp sniper for the utility, but on the other hand, it's not really that necessary, is it? Like, we're going for full all ins. I guess now that he knows we just completely destroy him, he might play it a bit more like disengagey. His pillar will help with that, but. I'll see what I can do. Not good, but I mean, it's Janna that got the kill, so it's like, you know, who cares? Alright. Okay, I need my level here. Come on! All right, now cue him. Like, what are you pinging for? Just like run in and kill him. Took the cannon too, huh? Nice. I sincerely hope that that trundle is now not ahead in levels. Sometimes, I guess. Should be fine. Just sucks because I had to share that whole wave with him. Which is good for him, but not, 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 not that great for us, specifically. Hmm. Should be able to get a little high from this wave if I'm, like, able to get on it, though. Yeah, he's got to be way more, uh, Kaidi than that. Serp just gave into my all-in. Hmm. Pretty sure I can just shoot up Maul him here. Got my ultimate and all. Flash, Ignite. Missed a plate, but I had to get that kill on him. I'm staying. They're not helping him. I wasn't necessary there. What a waste. Yeah, he completely missed all that. There's no, at least I died, but there's a wave to come back to. No, this is just the baseline difference between us now. Gotta love it, huh? Got a lot of like slows and stuff, so I'm kind of tempted to go for like a move speedy build with Shide. Yeah, no. We'll see. We'll see. If I kill Mary again, it's just done. Okay, let's go for a freeze. Don't worry, 
is. Watch it, guys. There he is. I hate more than people with sleeves. An ally has been slain. <laughs> you might want to stay down. Might wanna get that get that checked out. <laughs> you might want to get that one checked out, pal. Oof. That was close. Dude, Fiddle almost just had enough damage to just solo me there, which is insane. He straight up almost one shot me there with that ult. Ugh. Ugh. Alright, let's get some health, get some HP. Um, I'm thinking we can go for Merc Treads though. It says Swifties, just to help against the CC they got. Because that fear just reminded me that, hey, you know, if... It doesn't matter how fed I am, if I'm silenced or stunned to the point where I can't use my W, then it doesn't matter. So, might as well just get that tenacity in. Let's keep the freeze up, I guess. Do I need to? I'm gonna just limit test here. Because I have lifesteal, I can just hit the wave and like sustain if I get like a bad trade. You wanna go? And he's got no flash, right? <laughs> he can't stand a turret against me. Nice. And Fiddle's out of the picture. Good. No trundle flash. I'ma just do this whole thing. Proxy into make sure turret kills every single minion. Tunnel's just doing uh fiddles camps here. Every single one of them thinks they're the one to beat me. <laughs> okay. Huh. Could have sworn I saw the tunnel W there. I'm gonna drag these minions away so he doesn't get my XP. I'm still a little ticked off about the earlier gank. I mean, it wasn't a bad gank, it was just alright, but... Let's just say that... It was a little forced into a big wave. And... The XP cost wasn't negligible. Technique. Should get that wave entirely. It's gonna fall the next wave. A three level lead is no joke. I'll try to kill him here in one go. Hmm, didn't do that well here. He lives through that. That's convenient. Yep. All right, I gotta get out of here before they kill me. This is my business, and business is booming. It's down there. Where's the Vagar? Okay, I'll, yeah, he's there. I'll get the wave then. I don't want to sell my uh, 
the blade here for a Strybreaker. Especially when it can just be more greedy. Good. Let's see what I can do here. If they collapse on me, I'll just flash over like that. No farming for you, pal. Good. Need a three three fifty four. Shard mark treads. Only one of us is leaving. You got my money. <laughs> Rip, I should have just flashed over. What I could have done is flash like this and ult the Vagar into the Talio. That could have been better. I just greeted for the kill so I could recall on Stride Merc Treads. Not a good thing to do. Least of all because it uh turned a four level lead into a three level one. Which is still like huge mind you, it's just given how our backline is performing, it's gotta be way more. When life gives you lemons, punch life in the throat. Hmm. I kinda wanna go for a dead man's plate here. Just so I can run around and uh Bully the enemy. I used to risk my neck in the pit making someone else. Bro, I'm here. Like, if I'm like going bot or something, I get clearing this wave, but when there's stuff for you to farm and you're farming my wave, like, it's just insane. You know, like. <laughs> I don't know, this concept of like, oh, jungle tax is so stupid. It's like, what do you mean jungle tax? You're either going to help me push it, or you're not going to help me push it. That's it. It's the utility of the push itself. It's not jungle tax. But no, now junglers think they have to take farm every time they gank. At least the Rorak ones. Good. Decent amount of gold. I'm gonna keep farming. Their whole ball is here. We got out without an engagement, meaning we got away with the rules. Huh, so I got caught. Let's see if we can get behind him. Are you serious? Dude, fiddle fear. Ugh. Annoying. Dude, they were so perfect for killing too. Couldn't cast anything out of the ult. You're in my pit now. Whew. 
Oof, that was close. All right, I'm out of here. They should be fine on their own. I guess I'm gonna go for Shojin then, because we're going for the whole mobile sort of play style. Let's just sell this for the pickaxe. It's not that worth it. After Shojin, some movement speed options, DMP and stuff. Then this should be the build. Close to go Sterax. Yeah, that's a good choice, choice too. Mm -hmm. The build is taking form. The build is taking form. I've not used my Strybreaker yet. Pill for this jungle here. All for me. You got it? Dead as a doorknob, is that a saying? Oh, nice. I love this item. It's for people with no parents or families. Oh, uh, and I hate that so much. Yeah, this game is low-key just so troll. We're pushed up to their base. Let's just burn. Like, if I get a tiny amount of help in these kinds of fights, I don't see the enemy team putting up that much of like a resistance. No, mm. ah. No thinky about throwy in the towel. Nope. He's kind of surrounded. Get him. Get him. Dead. Actually went for that. Yeah, that was kind of insane. Oh, it works. But they're just kiting me out so much. These fights are not going to be easy on us, huh? Oh, we got her. I mean him. He flashed, he flashed, he flashed. Yeah, they have such like great zoning options. I think me and Yi are fine, like enough. I'm trying to tank it. Good. Come on, man. <coughs> like, the fiddle Vagar combo just messes me up so hard. Like, the fiddle can just take me out of the fight, and the Vagar, like, makes life hell for me because I can't do anything against this wall. Hmm. Okay, I need some assistance from the backliners here. <clears throat> At least a little.
thing is, they're kind of weak, aren't they? Yeah. Me and Yi are where most of our strength lies. Our backline's quite behind, so... Gotta play things more carefully, then. I'll just bait my teammates. I don't know. Like, I don't see any other, like, choice I have. Like, if Vagar and the Fiddle are fighting, then I'll go in. If they're not fighting, I'm gonna stay around and just side lane. I might go for a hole breaker even here. To play more into that. It was just, just gonna be super sweet. Like the extra MR. This kind of push does nothing if we're the only ones pushing. Yeah. We gotta just play on the defensive then. We don't really have the vision to, uh, to, to deal with the Fiddle. Dude, like... <laughs> Dude, I hate Hourglass! Also, how can they send so many people on me constantly? Ugh, I gotta just order them around. And just play around them. Yeah, I gotta just play with them. They can always send a disproportionate number of their manpower just on me. Straight up. Which does not help me carry this. Tell me she doesn't kill her. He kills her. Oh my god. He gets her too, right? I'm just following because okay, ah, uh, because they're gonna they might have like done a counter engage. I gotta just play the side lane, man, but not fight, just farm and flank when they're fighting. Like straight up, they just send their bot lane and like these four together on me or the Yi, the like for like the last ten minutes. So I've gotta just not play into that by just not being alone, or when I'm alone, I'm just not around them. But they get engaged on and killed, okay. Hmm. Can I get this turret here? I'll try. Well, I got the inhib at least. Just wait. Hmm. She's not in root range. Well, I'm still gonna go for just Hullbreaker. Fun. 
I'm trying to think of who I can basically go for kills on, but there's just like no clear target. Can't go for the Janna. Can't go for the Vagar because of Hourglass. Can't go for the Phil because of Hourglass. And I sh like surely can't go for the Jin because he's just too mobile. And if the Janna's around, I can't do anything. So it's just like, like undoable for me. We should be dead. and everything. Yeah, nice. He has an Arglas. Good. Surprised he actually stood there, but 1k on the E is quite good. Nice. That better be wit's end that you're going for. You can kind of go for like an inhib, but he has no R, so this might get dicey. Yep, he just straight up got, let them kill him. Uh, just straight up, just let them kill him. God. Well, that's fun. Might go for Titanic Hydra here. Get some more W damage so I can just flash W, burst someone down, I guess. In ideal terms. Nope, they're doing Baron. Um, this was an entirely stupid ultimate. Oh my god, this stupid silence, man. Ugh. I should just W preemptively, I guess, but I didn't take damage enough for a good W shield. Dude, that Talia R was just dumb. <laughs> like, it did nothing there. I couldn't move in. It just blocked me off from getting into position to ult them. Also, why didn't the Phil get stunned here from Talia's rocks? Is it because it's like a blink and not like a dash? Probably right. Let's go for the Janna. <laughs> Yeah, he just wasted his hourglass. Good. All right, good. He can kill him too. He can kill him too. Yeah, he can kill everyone here. Yeah, he can kill everyone. Good, good, good. Nice, good W, good W. Talk to Lily. Nice, nice, nice. That was clean. That was clean. That was clean. That was clean. Right, I think we can go for it. I think we can go for it. I'm just gonna send it. Run down mid with him. Yeah, we, we like our whole game plan was like a miracle like that. Just no other choice for anything. Gotta send it, gotta send it, no other, like... This is like the one golden opportunity where we can just end this game. Ah, oh, no! Come on. I'll get the other inhib at least. Okay, kill's a kill. Not gonna overstay there. Their fatherless duo is gonna CC lock me, stun me, and be invulnerable while I'm doing it. I don't know if that's a great idea. Dude, I get killed during the, the the silence, man. What is this? Let's get Starax too. I get killed during the silence. Ugh. So much damage, dog. What? <laughs> 
Has she even fought anyone? Yeah, I wouldn't stay there if I was her. <laughs> also, Fiddle's gonna ult somewhere. Yeah, he just got ran down. And he can't like go in on the Fiddle either, because he just point and click fears him. Uh, unwinnable. We're just gonna give them Mountain Dragon. Uh-oh. Alright then. Well, that's one kill. They can just slow them a bit. That could work for me. Good. Uh... What is this champ? What is this champ? Just ints the whole game and takes it. Oh my god. This game has so many dumb champs. GG. Oh, right, we're back. So, our gameplay, we're up against Malphite Top. This one is a very annoying matchup for Set because Malphite doesn't really fight us like other top laners. Right? He doesn't really get into our range. He kind of just pokes us and then runs away, and he's very effective at doing that due to his range. So, what we have to do is essentially go for a very trade-heavy setup. That's why I've done Grasp right here, because what Grasp allows us to do is go for short trades and have that extra bit of magic damage, because one, Lethal Tempo is not going to work against that slow and whatever, and Conquer, while it does work in all situations, it doesn't help us where we need help, which is short trades, which is like the whole point of like why this lane is so difficult, right? We're also going to go for W Max. I know it sounds kind of weird, but W Max lets us have a low cooldown on it earlier on. So what we can do is, like, get Grass procs, right? Run up to him, hook, auto, auto, and then go for a W. Right? So we get a tiny bit of tree damage and also grass damage, but it adds up, right? Kind of like that. Only one of us is leaving. Mm. I want to get the cannon with that W. <sighs> Should just go for the Malphite instantly. We have better grasp usage at least, so I'm happy with that. Hmm, it goes around though. Gotta be careful. Here he is. If I had W, I would have gone for the fight. Don't think that's enough. Come on, man. Just uh, insta flashes on me. That sucks. I almost felt that one. Should have gone for a auto Q auto auto instead of auto auto Q auto auto. Should have gone for the, the quick, quick trade. Greed there for that extra hit. If I did that, he would just straight up be dead. My bad. That's his flash down, which I hope is useful to the team. Huh? 
Oh, the Akshan showed up and killed him, huh? Yeah, that sucks. Oh, yeah, well, I'm not catching up to that. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, no. Ugh. Shouldn't have used my E on the wave there, but I thought that Lee would just kill the Echo and be done with it. I didn't think there would be like a larger scale engagement there. Come on, just missing everything. This isn't gonna work out, just leave. I'm about to lose it. I'm about to lose it. I was... I want level 6 for the minions! Okay, I gotta just reset. I don't know what's got me tilted, but something's got me tilted. Gotta just cool it. Grass is just gonna change the fact that I griefed and died. Mm. Gotta just farm like a normal human being. They called me Set the Beast Boy Bastard. Ha! Now it's Set the Beast Man Bastard. Not gonna lie, my autos are just completely off. Okay, mental reset, mental reset, mental reset. We got it. Come on. Straight up doing no damage. I should have gotten AD then. I think if I went for a long sword and a dagger, would have started laning better. Not terrible. His, his shield came up like just in time. Could be some funny business here. Junglers, huh? You hate him. That's it. <laughs> Not you love him or whatever, you hate him. That doesn't damage him. Okay. To push him out of lane. That lands? Oh, it's gonna feed the Malphite. <sighs> Dude. Junglers, junglers. Listen, where was Echo the whole time, man? The stat outside my lane the whole time, just waiting. Mm. Cool. 
Yeah, this one's just done. Loki, like we're getting camped out. It's not a champion that I can just. I guess Malphite, so I can't just beat him like by outskilling him. There's some champions just invalidate skill difference like Malphite, so. Let's just say it's a bit of a hopeless match. Let's see if I can kill the Akshan then. A swap would be nice, because like Sal's just straight up counters Malphite. Speed. Blech. Survive karma. Stun them. Ugh, should have angled it better. Uh, this sucks. Honestly, even if I'm up against Malphite in the future, I'm never gonna go to this setup. I just hate the lack of attack speed and stuff. Yeah, let's just like FF this one quickly and get it over with. It doesn't seem like there's gonna be. Anything fruitful coming out of this match. Like if the bot lane was winning or something or someone else was popping off, I'd maybe stay in it. Like I'd just support them, but no, it's not gonna happen. Four more minutes and we're free. W to me instantly. Anything? Nope. Only thing an honest living makes you is broke. It's a good turret here. Some gold from somewhere. Okay, well, I don't mind this. Like we're just so desperate that like this is good enough for us. armor. He practically did, did like zero damage to him. Okay, we're good a bit. Little break between the rounds. Then we come out swinging. Land the all attack first. Secure the cube. <laughs> yeah, rip. Like we tried, but dude, he's got 250 armor. We can't even like. We do no damage into it. And he also like <laughs> the the funnier part is, I can't even burst him down with my W, because he does such little damage <laughs> that he never like stacks up my W. <laughs> uh. Just the perfect, boring character to fight. Hmm. I'm gonna stun now. Not sure how much work I can do into the vein. Pretty sure if she's good enough, she can just completely outplay me. 
But I think I'm desperate enough to try my luck against the vein this match. Yeah, Federico was just quite tough to play against. Oh, let's call it. Oh my god. They just nobody even pressed now. <laughs> they all just pressed. Nobody even pressed yes, they all pressed no. Like how is this winnable? On what planet is this winnable? Who's pressing It's how many times you get back. Oh, alright, whatever. It is what it is, I guess. Mm, I think I've got to just like forget about the Malphite and just go for kills against their squisher members because I straight up can't snowball into him right like it's just it's like a brick wall I can't go through that Surely that's a kill. He does like 20 per auto attack. Oh my god. He does 20 damage per auto attack. You guys saw that, right? He hit him, Malphite went from 290 to like 278. Pop. Oh, I see, I see like a kill. Not a great kill. Hasn't really changed anything, but kills a kill. Not the best angle hang action. Gotta stay here. I'm kind of just gonna kill my enemies. Let's go. Oh, come on! He just straight up killed me in melee range. Ugh. Yeah, makes sense. He's holding him up on me. <sighs> Why are we still in this, man? No. Get me out. <laughs> Bro, guys, your lives doesn't depend on it. Okay, we can just FF this. Your lives doesn't depend on this match. Mm. Almost got him, man. A kill like that would just should bring me back into this match, though, so I'll keep going for it. We should get it. A rip. Karma does more damage to him than I do. Bro, that, that auto attack took so long to get out. Ugh. You guys saw that, right? It took me like ages to get that one auto attack out on the Malphite. I had to E him. Ugh. Stupid, stupid. All attack speed slow. I 
as I said before, I'm desperate enough to try my luck against the vein. <laughs> what? got other kills. I can't even chop into this meathead. He got an Iceborne too. Yeah, instead of 10 damage per auto, I'll do 9 damage per auto. Why do you even ult? <laughs> Does Silas one shot you, bro? Because I'm not doing anything here, am I? I think it's best if I go for like a supporty build then. Dead man's player to just run around, spam abilities, utility. The game lasts that long? Did I subconsciously press no on the surrender vote? Oh, nice try. Okay. They killed me through my shield. Rip. Alright, yes it guys. GG. Alright, I'll see you boys in the next one. Peace out. Oh, right, we're back from gameplay. We're up against Yon Top. This one is going to be a rough one because we have a full AD team. Yasuo and the Caitlyn are both crit damage dealers, so... Yeah, the Bruises are the only team are going to have a great time just, like, building death stands, toppies, and just completely avoiding our damage, which sucks. Now, um... As for our team, I feel like our overall team fighting is a bit worse, right? Because, like, they have Viego, who's a big character yon like every single champion they have has big like ultimates that can really mess up a team fight niko can single out and change one samir's got her old team fighting sort ability so yeah um we gotta play team fights very carefully essentially speaking we have a very supporty sort of peel backy kind of team which i guess helps against the akalis and stuff right so yeah I gotta ignite because I wanna get some kills out of this lane, get some work done. We're gonna be chilling out level one because that's just how it is. Try to go for a kill level three. It's all fun and games till someone gets their face caved in. Don't see you being the boss there, Buster. I had to avoid those cues there. The cracking of bones is the clinking of bones. He's dead. What do you mean, hardly? Just shit up defeated, dog. Hmm. Let's play with the wave here.
Or have lethal tempo? I thought I switched to Conqueror. What? I thought I switched to Conqueror. Man, the runes in this game. Alright, whatever. Definitely not a lethal tempo match. <laughs> like, it's not detrimental, but it's just not the match for it. Also, I'm gonna stay. Wanna kill this Yon again. Should be possible. There we go. Because I had lethal tempo, I was like, alright, I'm just gonna brute force and get as many kills as possible with it. That's like the power of lethal tempo. Essentially speaking, lethal tempo scales like... Not scales, it spikes early super hard, right? And then it kind of mellows out. So the whole idea is, um, you want to basically just use your lethal tempo power as much as possible to get as many brute force kills as possible earlier on, so that later on into the game, when it's not that useful, you can kind of just make up for that using how fed you are. Also, the game is going quite well. We got an extra kill here in mid lane, and I'm just crushing the lane, obviously, so... Yeah. Things are going quite nicely. So long as I don't waste my W, we should be good to go for, like, the whole game. Hmm. Nice. Ivor's just popping off. Good. Mama always said I had her temper. Hmm, this one's gonna be a rough shove. I dropped aggro first. This is a little dicey, but with ultimate I can just kill him. Must be a fight brewing. My Burgess stood up. Spirit unmoored. There we go. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah, he's level 4, bro. And the FF. Shortest game of all time. I'll see you boys in the next one. Peace out. Alright, we're back to our gameplay. We're up against Warwick top. The Orleans against Warwick are pretty um clear. Once you understand how his kit works in that... Warwick is at his most dangerous when he's got really low HP. That's when he can just auto attack like literally anything and get a lot of healing off. So our goal is essentially to save our abilities and then just burst him down in one go when he's low health, right? So we get him to like 300 HP or so. And then he proves to be a complete mouth breather by doing this. Just ints instantly. What is it wrong? <laughs> All right, whatevs. Hmm. <laughs> that was pretty good. Hmm. I'm kind of um, doomed in lane though, which sucks. I'll just stay in XP range. Try to get him to like dodge like diamond or turret. Let him take for turret shots. We might even be able to get a kill off with the J4 since he has no barrier. Not the worst auto overall. 
We got a decent chunk of change from those two assists. I wish I got one of the kills instead of the Thresh, but like the Ash kill was a bit too risky. If I went for it, Kane would have just killed me. Honestly, that wouldn't have been too bad because I would also get the reset, but giving a kill to Kane is a bit dicey. It's not something you do. Oh man. Best part about playing against Warwick Top, if anybody on your team is low HP, he just gets like <laughs> 500 blue speed. We survived so far. Jinx could just die already, so I, <laughs> I don't have to deal with this. There we go. Good. Got no barrier, I can do this. There we go. <laughs> Alright, let's see what's the next one. Peace out. Ah, oh, come on.